What's going on, chat? Welcome, welcome, everybody. If you're watching this in the future on YouTube, welcome to you as well. We'll start our briefing here in about 30 seconds. Dang, these guys are fast. These are TPC guys, Pilot Club guys. They waste no time. They were parked right next to me a few seconds ago. these guys depart and then we'll start our briefing. Uh oh. That can't be good. That cannot be good. At least it happened now on the runway before they were airborne. Whatever happened. Alright guys, let's start our briefing then. All right, so today is a uh, TPC fly-in Thursday, as usual. Thursday nights, TPC hosts these big fly-ins. Tonight, it's featuring Teterboro Airport, Tango Echo Bravo in New Jersey. Uh, the event's from 8 p.m. to 11 p.m. Eastern. Should be real busy when we get there. Um, if it's too busy and we can't get in, we can always cancel IFR and go somewhere else, one of the many airports in the area. I'm not worried about that too much. Um, we'll try to make it in there if we can't or if they ask us to hold for forever. We can uh, certainly divert elsewhere. We'll be flying into Teterboro. We're going to be flying out of uh, College Park in Maryland, uh, just northeast of Washington, D.C. Charlie Golf Sierra. It's a small class golf airport. Class golf right here. Like I said, just northeast of, uh, is this IAD or is that Dulles? DCA. IAD is Dulles. <laughs> All right, DCA, Reagan. We're right here. Uh, weather here at College Park right now. Winds are calm. 10 statue miles. We got an overcast layer at 8,000. Temp 7. Uh, dew point minus 1. Altimeter 3013. Overcast at 9. It's looking that way pretty much all in this area until we get out of the Maryland area and a little bit further up north. Getting closer into New York. Should start to open up a little bit. Uh, weather over there at Teterboro right now, uh, winds are 220 at 7, 10 statue miles clear, 6 minus 1, altimeter 3013. And we are IFR today. We're going to be flying in the TBM. Well, here's a look at our route. We're going to be direct paleo, then the V170 to Swan, and then we're going to be on the Maisie 3 into Teterboro. We're going to go up to flight level 19 or 0. Should take us, I think it's going to take us a little bit longer than that. Maybe 45 to 50 minutes to get there. And we are doing it in the TBM 930. Which I don't even think I've ever flown this airplane on stream yet. I've flown it once or twice off stream. Super nice airplane. I do have the mod loaded 
from flightsim.to. So it should be fun. Let's see how we do in the TBM today. I'm bound to make a bunch of mistakes because I'm not too familiar with it. I do have my checklist here. So we'll be going by that. All right, let's see if this guy gets off the ground again, or this time rather. And then we'll, we'll get started. He's got his door open. Is that because I have my door open? All right, he's up. <laughs> I think the next one here is Surge, Mr. TPC6. Nope, that's not him. Uh, I think he already departed. He was the one waiting behind that guy. I'm not sure who this is here. All right, let's get the airplane started. All right, cockpit prep, all of our lights and crash levers down. All lights are all off. Crash lever is down. Starter's off, ignition is... Uh, actually, ignition goes to auto. Ignition, auto, aux BP is off. Fuel selector's on manual. AP trims is off. Inertial SEP and de-ice is all off. Parking brake is on. Uh, landing gear lever is in the down position. Bleeds are off. Throttle cut off. And fuel tank, fuel tank selector left to right. We've got it on the left side. Airplane's already been fueled. I double checked fuel this time so we won't run out like yesterday. Was that yesterday that we did that? <laughs> We're all good there. We should have plenty to get to Teterboro and plenty more if we need to divert or anything like that. Uh, before starting engine, crash lever up. Source bat. And generator to main. DI systems, lights test. Landing gear, light check down. And fuel on board. We're good to go. All right, engine start, ignition to auto. Taz system test, okay. Already on auto, aux BP is going to auto. It goes to on, propeller area clear, and then our starter. Let's get our lights on, nav and strobe. And we're ready to start this thing. Hold the starter for two seconds. One, one thousand, two, one thousand, three. NG begins to rise. We're going to introduce fuel to low idle at 13%. 13. 9. 10. 11. Just going to monitor our ITTs, NG, prop, and torque. Make sure nothing goes crazy. Or nothing gets hung up. And at 50, starter comes off automatically. We have the white light starter here that extinguished. Just waiting for everything to stabilize. After engine start, throttle to flight idle. Everything is stable, so we'll go up one more click. Oil press oil temp is in the green. Aux BP to auto and fuel select to auto. 
and our AP trim can come on. Generator main and bleeds to auto. Before taxi, inertial separator on. Flight control check. Aileron left, aileron right, elevator up, elevator down, rudder left, rudder right. Flight controls free and correct. Flaps up. Throttle will feather twice. Sorry, I still haven't figured this out yet. Um, all right, so to feather, do we move this to the right? Is that how that works? Alright, one time. Two times. Taxi lights on and parking brake off. Alright, let's uh, call for our clearance. I think we're going to be talking to IAD approach to pick up our clearance. We'll see if he gives it to us here on the ground. If not, we can depart out of here VFR and then pick it up in the air. We should have ATC the entire way today. All right, let's try. Not too sure. Let's see. Uh, Alright, I think it's Potomac on, uh, Approach that we need to be Delta talking Ranch, to. Uh, and I think they are online. With Potomac on. Approach is going to be on uh, 11985. On 1985. Victor, Delta, contact departure 119.7. 119.7, thanks, November 2 or Alright, let's pick up our clearance. Pilot Club 74, clear direct paleo. Clear direct paleo, Pilot Club 74. Potomac Approach, good evening. TBM 5615 November. November 5615 November, go ahead. TBM 5615 November is on the ground at College Park. Charlie, Golf, Sierra with the weather request IFR to Teterboro. Tango, Echo, Bravo. Pilot Club 74, contact departure 119.7. You can climb maintain 11,000. Have a good night. Uh, give me the park speed one more time, Pilot Club 74, sorry. Pilot Club 74, 119.7, and 11,000, good night. 11,000, 119.7, Pilot Club 74, good night. November 5, 6, 1, 5, November, clear to Teterboro Airport as filed, maintain 5,000, expect flight level 19010 10 minutes after departure. Departures with me, Squawk 2425. TBM 5615 November, clear to Teterboro as filed. Climb maintain 5000, expect flight level 190 and 10. Departure with you, squawk 2425. November 15, November, read back, crack down, cemetery 3013, about to ready taxi for runway 15. 3013, and we'll advise on ready to taxi 15, 15 November. All right, we've got our clearance. Let's get a route plugged in. Gonna be out of College Park. KCGS, College Park, enter. Destination's gonna be Teterboro, KTEB. Teterboro, enter. It's gonna be direct paleo. Public approach, walking for it, man. Walking for it, man. I just uh, wanted to run by you real quick. Uh, before we depart, how do we avoid the uh, restricted airspace? Do you go direct swan or is there a 
Paleo, that V-170 to the Swan. Uh, well, Let me see. I don't even think there's any... actually just north of the field, so you should be all right. We would just, uh, I think it's Paleo ahead. direct Swan. Let me just right, double check. Thank Paleo, yeah, Swan is the very next waypoint on V-170, so I'm just going to enter in Swan right after Paleo. You thug for going for 9 to get the end of uh, Juliet, which we're ready to go for 1-9. Uh, Locker 49, fly runway heading, one one four zero four runway one nine, clear for Jago. Take off one. And then it's going to be the Maisie 3 into um, into Teterboro, so our arrival procedure. We're going to do the Maisie 3. Go on, trans. We'll leave the runway open, and we'll load that. All right, beautiful. That looks good. There's our route. All righty, altimeters three zero one three. Three zero one three, three zero one three. We're going up to five thousand. Five thousand, and we're going to be departing runway one five. Bug in one five zero. And our transponder code 2425. Number 6 for uniform, follow the river inbound, runway 19, clear for the option, wind 1404. 2425. Follow the river inbound, Charlie. 19, clear for the option, 2464 uniform. Walker 489, radar contact, climb and maintain 17,000, <laughs> unable to stay altitude. Or, I'm sorry, 7,000, stay altitude. Uh, 1200 for 7,000. Roger. Uh, he told me to call him for taxi? That's kind of weird. Alright. That is 2170, contact approach 126.1. Let's do our before lineup stuff now. Brakes are on, lights. We'll get those on later. We've got all we need for now. We'll get our taxi light on once we start rolling. Uh, lights, ignition to auto, OxyBP auto, fuel select, audio, de-ice as required, pedo heat is coming on. Inertial SEP is on, trim. There's up, there's down. And then somewhere in the green mark there for takeoff. Rudder trim, I'm kind of, I think I'm going to keep it where it's at. Maybe a little bit. No, I'm going to keep it where it's at. All right, a little bit of right rudder. I feel like in the green there's a little bit too much, but we'll put it right in the left edge of there, the green, for takeoff. Flaps. We're coming into the first notch. Uh, bleeds are on auto. Altimeters are checked and set. And our uh, alt selector set and transponder. Logger 49, we're squawking mode, Charlie. Two, four, two, five. Okay, we're ready. Get our taxi light on. Just my seat. Ugh. All right, I'm on the brakes. Parking brakes coming off. Potomac Approach, TBM 5615, November is ready to taxi 15 at College Park. November 5615, November, runway 15, taxi route at pilot's discretion. Pilot's discretion to runway 15, TBM 15, November. Alright, here we go. We're all clear. Clear right. Clear left. Uh oh, what happened?
happened. It's something with the the way my mixture lever works on my throttle. It makes something go wrong in this airplane. Let's restart it. Let's wait for it to cool down. It's funky the way the TPM controls this in this airplane. It's not very intuitive. It's hard to get it to where I want it to go. Let's try that again then. Alright, starter. Goodness. These click spots suck too. 1 1000, 2 1000, 3. idle. Then at 50% NG or 52% we should see the starter come off. This little white light on the cast. There it goes. I bet this is what happened to the guy that was taking off that we saw lose the engine. Alright, everything's stable. We're going to come to a high idle now. Let me see if I can move my mixture thing up if this works. No. Alright, I tell you what. I'm going to leave it in the up position this time. Pull this back. Two four six twenty four mon final one nine DCA. Let me wait for things to cool down again. This is not pilot error, I promise you. This is like a control control calibration issue with this particular airplane. No problem. Since you have one lever that controls both or all TPMs, and I have three different levers down here that I'm moving around. All right, let's try again. Third time's a charm, let's go. One one thousand, two one thousand, three. Looking for thirteen percent NG. Low idle. Monitoring. At 52%, starter should come off. There it goes. Walker 489, contact departure, 109.7, you have a great flight. 109.7, Walker 489, good day. All right, finally. All right, chat. We're good. Let's go. We're clear right, clear left. In sim or in real life too? I don't. I don't understand your question, compilation kid. Clear right, clear left. You mean the starting issue? It's a simism thing. Alright, I'm gonna start getting all my lights on. That's it, we're all ready.
I think I know how I'm going to do it next time to not run into that issue. I'll leave my mixture and my prop lever full forward before I start messing with the one in the sim. I had them both down, so when I tried to move them up, the sim read it as they were down and then they shut down the engines. Potomac Approach, TBM 5615 November, ready to go, runway 15 at College Park. Number 15 November, runway 15, clear for takeoff, fly runway heading. Runway heading, clear for takeoff, 15, TBM 15 November. Clear right. Clear left. We're going to rotate at 90. Um, Potomac, losing engine on the runway, max braking. Below 1,000, we're landing straight ahead. And above 1,000, we'll turn back for College Park. Good. Good, uh, that is 1286. Potomac departure, climb maintain, level 190. Pretty short runway here at College Park, so I'm going to hold the brakes. Up to flight level 190 for United 1286. Throttle up. Engine's good, let's go. Airspeed's alive. Seventy. All, all the runaway. Ninety. Brakes and gear up. That is 1286, climb and maintain flight level 190. Up to flight level 190 for uh, United 1286. Potomac approach 97, tell us when 0000. That is 712, don't wait to departure, today. climb and maintain flight level 230. Alright, safe altitude speed check, Just flaps are coming up. Number 15, November, radar contact, climb and maintain. Uh, Climb and maintain flight level 190. Flight level 190, 15 November. Alright, so let's go into autopilot and yaw damp. We're going to do heading and level change. Well, Topic approach, good evening, America 26 here with you. We're, We're going up to flight level. To the Chicago International Information Problem. American 260, Potomac departure today. 190. Airport, wing 5 departure, Rami transition, and then file. Walk two three six one. All right, we're here at Chicago International as files. Walk at two three six one for American two six zero. American two six three back correct runway one nine for departure. Advisory taxi. At one nine for departure. We'll advise the taxi two six zero. One nine zero is in there, and we're climbing at one hundred and twenty four knots, which is the best climb for the TBM. That's a six taxi runway one nine. Southwest 66, runway 19, taxi via Kilo Cross, okay. runway 15, altimeter 3014. Kilo Cross 15 for Southwest 66. Target 520, I'd like to pick up our uh, clearance with Bravo. Target 520, tell me departure today, clear to Atlanta, airport, clutch 3 departure. After takeoff, gears up, flaps up, up torques max 100. 7, 4, 1. DA says required an inertial separator. Uh, clear to spot. Come off for uh, now. We'll have to get it back on once we get in the clouds. There. Well. Roger. November 15 November, clear direct paleo. Direct paleo, 15 November. Alright, direct paleo. That is 1286, contact center, it's going to be 133.72, 33.72. Over to uh, 3372 for United 1286 Heavy. Jeez, why is it overcorrect so much, man? Gotta spam it. Alright, 1286, 
We're going up to flight level 190. Seven twelve contact center one three three point seven two. Good day. Side of seven twelve contact center one three three point seven two. One two three seven two for seven twelve. See ya. See ya. All right, going in the clouds now. We're gonna get our ice on. And our inertial separator is coming on. Nearby Washington Tri-C Class Bravo Airspace. Number one five November contact departure one one nine point seven. Good day. One one nine point seven one five November. Good day. Departure, good evening. TBM 5615 November is climbing through 7700 for flight level 190. TBM 5615 November, Potomac approach, climbing to 14000, Baltimore altimeter is 3013. 14000, 3013, 15 November. 3013 is in there, we're going to stop at 14000. Fourteen thousand, I see it. For a direct paleo. Nearby Washington Tri B Class Bravo Airspace. TBM 15 November contact Washington Center 125.45. 125.45 TBM 15 November. See ya. Sonic Rapid Dunk Brooks will be right back. 12545. Washington Center, good evening. TBM 5615 November is climbing through 10,800 for 14,000. November 5615 November, Washington Center, hello. The fill, correction, the Baltimore altimeter 3013, climb and maintain flight level 190. Flight level 190, TBM 15 November. November 11816, contact New York Center 127.72. 2772, 860. 190, see it. Be a pretty breakout out of the clouds here. Get above this overcast layer. Notorious Q7, what's going on? Welcome. How you doing today? Washington approach, no, number two shot there is with the 12,000. Over to Juliet Sierra Washington Center. Uh, hello, climb and maintain flight level uh, 270. Up to 270, 270. Did we get out yet? No? And Washington Center, Walker 489. <coughs> Walker 489. I'm going to move climb up to uh, 
What's the either How's everybody doing back there? The Comfortable? The plane is so nice. Uh, Walker 489. The highest I can give you is 16,000. Would you want that? Hey, we made I'll it through. It. Okay, Walker 489, climb and maintain 16,000. 16,000, Walker 489, thank you. And it's very on sure. I got a question for. Sure. Uh, yeah, uh, I just want to know, did I, have I passed the Smyrna VOR Echo November Oscar, or am I not? Because my MD is saying that I passed it a while ago, but my charts are saying that I've not even passed it yet. Yeah, Spirit Wings 9754, you passed that VOR 15 miles ago. All right, Roger, yeah, so my charts are still so haven't even passed them yet, thanks. All right, we're over Paleo now, left turn to Swan. Washington Center, pilot to 515, level 410. Pilot Club is uh, 515 Washington Center, low cross Jakey at 13,000. The Philly Altimeter, 3014. Jakey at 13,000, Pilot Club Turn our ice and our inertial separator off now that we're above the clouds. Number two, Julia Sierra, contact New York Center 125.32. Good day. Over 125.32. Good day, two zero. Walker 489, a pilot's discretion, maintain 1 2 12,000, Philly altimeter, 3014. We'll one, switch to an outside view real quick, it might be loud, just a warning. November 5615, uh, November cross Jakey at 1 2 12,000, the Philly altimeter, 3014. Cross Jakey at 1 2 thousand, uh, TBM 15 November. Jakey at 1 2 thousand. Alright, we're crossing through flight level 180, so altimeters are going to go to standard 2992. Two nine nine two. I'll level off at 19. Spirit wings 9754. Alright, I don't know if this thing has a working beat now. Let's see if we can put 1,000 feet to go. How's that beep you heard? We're leveling at 19. Let's see if we can put in... Jakey, one two thousand. Enter. Now, I wonder if VNAV will actually work. It's got Buzzy at seventeen. It looks like it will. We're gonna try it. Cool. If it works. I'll be impressed. All right, leveling off at nineteen. Glance down here, make sure we're not over torqued, everything's in the green, everything is happy and healthy. Two four seven Delta Echo, flight level four three zero. Roger.
Caution in Center, November 982, Romeo Sierra is just north of the Flat Rock via water, uh, flight level 410. Just my neck Romeo Sierra, Washington Center, hello, cross Jakey at 13,000. The Philly altimeter 3014, do not exceed 270 knots in the transition. Cross uh, Jakey 13,000, do not exceed uh, 270 knots in the transition. Uh, November 982, Romeo Sierra. Right, cruise checklist. Altimeters are checked and set. Autopilot set. Fuel gauges checked. De-ice, don't need it. Inertial SEP is off and lights. Get our landing light off. Cruise checklist complete. Custom livery? No, I think this is one of the defaults, I think. It's new though, I never noticed this one before. Dang, this airplane is super nice. Got to sit in one of these brand new at the uh, aircraft expo in Naples. Walker 489, contact New York Center 127.72, good day. 127, good day. DG Center, Southwest 66, climbing to the level 212. Southwest 66, Washington Center, Roger. We're doing 364 knots over the ground. I don't think this ETE is accurate. Can't be. Yeah, ETE, we're gonna be on the ground in about maybe 25, 30 minutes. Alright, Buzzy, we should be at 17. Alright, let's try this VNAV thing. Let's put in, uh, let's put in 12. Lacrosse, Jakey. Mark your mark at 2846, ready to go at 3 12,000, and let's see if VNAV works. Last station calling, say again. Mark at 2846, ready to go at 3 is armed, and hopefully sometime before uh, Buzzy. We should start Whoever descending. Whoever landed on this frequency on the ground somewhere, you're on the wrong one. Return to your last frequency and double check with them. Let's see if it works. If we're not descending by Buzzy, then we're going to go to level change mode and do it ourselves. There were five, uh, November 5615, November contact New York Center 127.72. 127.72, 15 November, see ya. Center on uh, 3372, that's uh, Washington Center, uh, 3372 from American Tolo 2, thanks. Have a great night. American Tolo 2, actually, disregard, you can stay with me for now. Okay, Roger, with you then, uh, Tolo 2. Center, good evening, TBM 5615, November, flight level 190. Uh, TBM 5615, November, New York Center, Roger. All right, still in there, Jakey at 12. We're not descending yet. I don't trust it. All right, let's do level change. November 7, Victor Delta, to 789,000, the Philly altimeter, 3014. And we'll just pull the power back a little bit. And altimeter 3014, November 7, Victor Delta. New York Center, give me a citation uh, for it. Mike, go back with you, 5350. November 4, Mike, go back, New York Center, Roger. On the 26 Trust Wilkes-Barre at and maintain flight level 180. Wilkes-Barre at and maintain flight level 180, Puck 26 New York Center, TBM 5615 November is vacating flight level 190 across Jakey at 12,000. 
Alpha Bitter 3014. 3014, 15 November. New York Center, good day. Synthetic 632 Heavy, currently passing 17,000 of the flight level 320. 3014. Synthetic 632, New York Center, Roger. Hala, Yintain, Fadamal 250. Hala, Yintain, Fadamal 250, Synthetic 632 New York Center, uh, pilot number 515 is uh, 18,000, sorry, 18.5 for uh, 13,000. Pilot number 515, New York Center, Roger, the Philly Alpha Letter 30114. Walker 489, disregard. New York Center, 515, November, descend via the Macy's rearrival, Philly Alpha Letter 30114. Descend via the Macy 3, Altimeter 3014, TBM 15, November. All right, Maisie 3, pulling that up now. So we're coming up on Jakey, 12,000. Then we're going to want to be at Eileen, 12,000. Wacky at 11. Uh, Regal at 7,000. And that's it. No speed restrictions, just altitude. Got a 7,000, I'm going to send so Jakey at 12, Eileen at 12, and then Wacky at 11. November 11816, contact New York Center, 132.8. We'll power back some more. 3280. We're about November over Jakey now, we're supposed to be at 12,000. Number 7, Victor Delta, New York Approach, 132.8. Correction, 132.8. 132.8. I'll get my lights on going in the clouds. Lights. Frontier flight 1532, radar contact. And ice and inertial separator. 4.7. Also coming out. Frontier Flight 1532, Roger. Direct to Woodstown, Club I maintain 1 2000. 12,000, Direct Woodstown, uh, Frontier Flight 1532. Actually, November 5, 615, November, maintain, maintain 1 3000 for traffic. 1 3000, 1 5 November. Walker 49, to set maintain 1 uh, 2000. We're going to stop here at 13. 1 2000, Walker 49. Delta 659, Potomac Approach 1 1.7. Potomac 119.7659. Alpha 910 cross Muggsy at and maintain 6000 to your bro altimeter 3013. Alpha 910 cross Muggsy at and maintain 6000 to your bro altimeter 3013. Why is she still descending? Thing is weird, man. I just sent uh, across Muggy at 6,000, Town 910. That was pretty wild. AP disconnect. Alright, 13. Walker 489, to set up maintain. So, disregard. AP, nav, AP again. See if it stays at 13 this time. Walker 49 to set up maintain 1 1000. 1 1000, Walker 49. They hit 13, where are you going? Alright, I think it's doing it this time. Southwest 659, Potomac approach 1 1 honor point 7. FedEx 632, Columbia maintain, Fadable 320. Up to Fadable 320, FedEx 632. We're going to shoot this little gap right here. Stay out of this stuff. It's pretty nasty in there. The stuff we just came out of. Yeah, it's not a good time flying through that stuff. Damn, that airplane looks good. Center, Southwest 66, 
crossing Dakey at level 130, 13,000. Frontier flight 50, 32, contact Washington Center, 125.45. 2545, do you want us to stay at 12 until we go over? Affirmative. Okay, uh, see you later. For a front Another one of the Delta cross for late 8 at Delta, hold short of 35 a kilo. Cross Delta, hold short 35 a kilo, one room at Delta. I'm sorry. Number 8, Mike, you go back across Wilkes there at a main dam, side of all 180. Trust that's a 18044, make it back. And on New York Center, Southwest 66, uh, descending to 1350. Southwest 66, Roger, the Philly altimeter, 3 0 4. Southwest 910, New York Bridge, 123.77. Pilot 515, say to get an airspeed. Uh, 345. November 5615, November, just gonna maintain 10,000. 10,000, 15, thanks, just gonna maintain 1, 1,000. Down to 1, 1,000, pilot 515. Via the Jake Four to set, check altimeters are checked and forward. set. Fuel gauges checked. I mean the Jake D arrival for top of the Route of the clouds now. Channel 910, New York Bridge, 123.7. Inertial set seven. is coming off. 1, 2, Four three, to set, check is complete. Affirmative. Right. Five, eight, twenty six, trust mugs, the other maintain 6,000 feet of row altimeter, 3014. 3014, Muggsy 6000, 5 Cubby 26. November 8, Wonder Romeo Delta, wind 1 liner, short 3 0 left, heading 3 0 0, runway 3 5, clear for takeoff. Heading 3 0 0, clear for takeoff, Wonder Romeo Delta. November Wonder Romeo Delta, actually correct your fly runway heading, runway 3 5, clear for takeoff. Runway heading, uh, 3 5, clear for takeoff, Wonder Romeo Delta. Let's get a weather update. New York Center for American Culture, 2 2 I'm uh, still sticking with you. Very can 12 zero two step by. Winds are out of the south southwest two one zero at five. Ten statue miles visibility sky clear temp four dew point minus two alternative three zero one four. All right two one zero. One five November to set to maintain nine thousand. Nine thousand one five November. So we can expect south flow, it's either going to be runway 19 or runway, I think they have a 24. 24 and 19. We can expect one of those two runways. November to set a maintain 7,000. 7,000, 1-5 November. New York, good evening. Challenger 650, November Sierra, level 370. Challenger 650, November Sierra, New York Center, Roger. American 2484, uh, spot 9, Philadelphia, taxi. Uh, Cup 515, turn left, heading 270, Victor, sequencing into Teterboro. Left, 270 for uh, 
Flight level 5 at Dan. New York Center, November 9 2 Rem US Sierra on a JK3 arrival, passing uh, flight level 200 on our way to uh, 13000. November 2 Rem US Sierra, New York Center, Roger. American 2840, runway 27 left, taxi via Mike, Papa, Sierra 1, cross runway 27 right. Mike, Papa, Sierra 1, cross 27 right, American 2840. New York Center, Pilot Club 538 is at flight level 350. Thousand feet to go. November one five November contact New York to approach one three two point eight. One three two point eight one five November see ya. Walker forty nine to set maintain seven thousand. 32.8 New York Approach, good evening, TBM 5615, November 7000 TBM 5615, November, New York Approach, good evening, Squawk 1052 1052, 15 November One zero five two. November five six one five November radar contact uh, seven miles from uh, eight miles from Salisbury VOR altitude indicating six thousand four hundred. Distance to maintain four thousand. Teed up route altimeter three zero one four. Three zero one four with descent and maintain four thousand. TBM one five November. Four thousand. Level change. And 3014 is in there. Uh, Walker 489, New York approach, you with me? That's yes, her. Walker 489, New York Approach, good evening. Tita Brown, Tim for 3014, expect uh, vectors, visual approach, runway 1-9-er. I wonder if we can do the ILS as possible. Uh, Walker 489, you can expect vectors, ILS, runway 1-9-er. Vectors, ILS, 1-9-er, Walker 489, uh, thank you. All right, the arrival ends here after Gonzo. So I guess we'll just maintain present heading. I'm going to switch over to heading mode. Until he gives us some vectors or some instructions. Otherwise, the autopilot's going to take us direct to Teterboro. Not what we want. Um, yeah. So I'm just going to stay on present heading. Walker 489, just maintain 4000. Maintain 4000, Walker 489. Approach TBM 5615 November. We don't have anything plugged in after the Maze E3. Do you just want us on our present heading for now? Uh, November uh, 15 November. You can actually turn left heading 040. Left turn 040, 15 November. Pilot Club 515, New York approach. Better to be safe and ask then. 
Pilots out 515 New York approach. And we were all both on the same page. 19 or Tito Bravo, temperature 3014. Looks like they're using 19. I'm going to put in the ILS, even though you'll probably set us up for the visual. So we'll go procedure. Approach. 210, Roger, pilots out 515. You'll let me do it. Tito Bravo, approach. Uh, Southwest 66, uh, heading 090. Southwest 66, New York approach, Cedar Brow, temperature 3014, expect Vectors, ILS, run 19er. Vectors, ILS, 19er, Southwest 66. Why won't it let me modify the procedure? Not good. Walker 489, turn left, heading 010, Vector for sequence. Uh, 010, Vector for sequence, 1049. November 15, November, contact New York approach 127.6. Have a good night. 127.6, 15 November, good night. Good night. Nearby New York class Bravo airspace. Southwest to 66, turn left heading 020. Why won't it let me put the ILS in here? Now I'm getting a little worried. Let's see. Procedure. Try it this way, then go here. Teterboro, no. Weird. New York approach. Good evening, TBM five six one five November four thousand heading zero four zero. November one one eight one six descend to maintain two thousand. Hey one one eight one six. My friend Brant, Mr. Melvin Leroy. TBM five six one five November four thousand heading zero four zero. TBM 5615 November, New York approach, Roger. Talon flight, uh, Talon 910, turn right at 130. 130, Talon 910. New York approach, good evening, Talon 8260, heading uh, 5000 for 4. Six New York approach, send to maintain 3,000. 3,000, talk about November 11816, three miles from, uh, or two miles from Montville, turn right heading 160, maintain 1,500 until established, cleared ILS from right 19 or approach. Uh, turning right 160, we'll maintain 1,500 until established, cleared right, the ILS, ILS 19 approach, November 11816. We might just have to ask for vectors if I can't get it plugged in. Send to maintain 2,000. 2000, Talon 910. I don't know why Number it's not. Victor Delta, turn right heading 130. Right heading 130, and remember. ILS 19, localizer frequency 110.15, approach course 195. We've got 6230 feet of runway, touch elevation 6. Um, Teterboro Tower is going to be on 119.5. Uh, we're going to want to be at Unville, either above 2100. Then tugs are final approach fix at or above 1500. Minimum is going to be 219. You know, November 11816. So if we have to go speed, miss, we'll climb to 500. Then climbing right turn to approach speed and over to cross tower. budget 1500. Then climb to 3000 on track 275 to exam and hold. Then you climb and hold to 3000. All right, it's briefed. 11915. Localizer Here, sir, frequency. Good evening. 654 Bravo out of 5000 for 4000. Talon 910, four miles from Unville, turn left heading 220. Uh, maintain 2100 until established, clear the ILS from the 19 approach. Alright, here's the comms. How do I get to the nav side? Sorry, I need that again. This is a left heading at 220. Alright, nav 1. Right turn heading 220. 11015. Heading 220, 2100 now until established on the localizer. Hey, why didn't it take it? Clear the ILS from the 19 approach, Talon 910. Pilot Columbia 26, turn left heading 360, vectors for spacing. Wait, 11016, Pilot Columbia 26. 015, enter. New York approach, Sandra 654, whiskey Bravo, 4.2 for 4. November 654, whiskey Bravo, New York approach, roger. Uh, 11015. November 247, Victor Delta, descend to maintain 2000. Okay, it's in there. How do I flip flop it? There we go. Alright, beautiful. We've got the ILS frequency in there now. 
Approach frequency 19 or 5, that looks like it's already set automatically. Okay, we're okay for now. Good evening, Approach Pilot Club 515, with information Mike, level 4000. Pilot Club 515, there, approach, roger. Approach checklist, altimeter set, fuel gauge is checked, de ice as required. Uh, inertial set is coming on. Remember, it is on. Delta, uh, lights are on. Six miles from Funville, turn right heading 160. Maintain 2100 until established on the localizer. Clear to ILS runway 19 approach. We're right heading 160. Maintain, uh, I believe you said 2100 until established on the approach. Still don't know why it's not letting me put runway the procedure approach in approach here, control. though. Kind of weird. Procedure, approach. Why wouldn't it let me select that? Pilot Club 26 turn right heading 130. Right, 130, Pilot Club 26 Okay, we're good with just the ILS frequency. Bravo, turn left heading 360, vectors for sequence. 360, vectors for the sequence, 654 at Bravo. 5615 November, turn left heading 330, vectors for sequence. Left turn 33015 November. Talent 910, contact Peterborough Tower, 119.5, good day. 195, Talent 910. like they're vectoring people into the localizer anyway, so we should be fine as long as they don't give us a direct two fix. And even if they did, I've got Garbin Pilot here. Just got all the fixes. We can just kind of wing it using heading mode. We'll get by. Rohype, oh my god! It's that flight sim dude. Hope you had a wonderful day. Hey, thanks for hype. <laughs> Same to you, man. Flying the TBM 930 today. I think first time on stream and probably my second or third time flying it in the sim. Five four whiskey Bravo. Turn right heading zero nine zero. Getting getting by so far. Right turn heading zero nine zero six five four whiskey Bravo. We'll be on the ground in Teterboro in less than ten, hopefully. Exercise today, Rohype. Hype. Zero approach, uh, Southwest 66, heading zero one zero. Southwest 66, near approach, Roger. November 247, Vicar Delta, contact Teterborough Tower, 1 at 9.5, good day. 9.5, have a good night, November 7th. Gonna be our next uh, frequency, all in 9.5. Speed 180, uh, Pilot Cup 826. Cooper 654, Whiskey Bravo, turn right heading 130, descend to maintain 3000. 130, 3000, 654, Whiskey Bravo. Pilot Club 515, turn left heading 360, vectors for sequence. Left 360, Pilot Club. had an unexpected night flight last night, so been a bit of a dinosaur today. Got home at 4 a.m., went to bed at 8 or so, and slept till 2. 4 miles from Unville, turn right heading, uh, keep disregard. Pilot Club Nice, man, just finished Six. nightly exercise, good. Uh, she got something in. Turn right heading uh, 220. Right 220, maintain 3000, Pilot Club 826. Yeah, my workouts have been okay at best this week. I haven't been that motivated. Ever since I got back from you know where, I've been kind of feeling. Five, six, eh. one, five November, turn right heading one three zero. Right turn one three zero one five November. Yeah, feeling sluggish since getting back from. Walker forty nine air approach Roger. The keys. Was that a 130 heading? Did I hear that right? <laughs> I 
<laughs> it sure will, real hype. <laughs> Spitting facts, man. Wait, one three zero. Where am I going? Uh, copy twenty six. Turn right, heading two nine or zero. Right two ninety. Uh, copy twenty six. Southwest 66, turn right heading 040. Right 040, southwest 66. The number 654, Mosquito Bravo, 5 miles from Unville, turn right heading 160, maintain 2100 until established on the localizer, clear to ILS from way 19 or approach. 160-2100-Southside-Spirit-Island-19-654-0 Such a slick looking airplane, TBM Pilot Club Flight 15, turn right heading 090, descend to maintain 3000 090, down to 3000, pilot Club Flight 15 November 5615 5, November, descend to maintain 3000 3015 November Walker 49, turn right heading 090 090, welcome for a dime. Good evening, Dr. Mike, so the one's descending through 512 for 4000, heading 090. Southwest 66, descending 3000. Remain 3000, Southwest 66. Back on 831, they are to approach. Roger, traffic at your uh, 3 o'clock, 2 miles, sending out of 4000 is uh, 737. Stay jumping side, don't come back to the one. Ouch, row hype. Serious stuff there, man. I hope the kid was okay. Duck on 831, turn left heading 030, vectors for sequence. Left on 030, don't come back to the one. Number 654, Whiskey Bravo, contact Teterboro Tower, 119.5, good day. Teterboro Tower, 965654, Whiskey Bravo, good day. New York approach, number 982, Romeo Sierra is with you at 4,000 feet. Number 982, Romeo Sierra, New York approach, Roger. Pilot code 515, turn right heading 130. Right 130, uh, pilot code 515. Alright, as soon as he gives us vectors for final, I'm gonna engage, I'm gonna record replay this time. I always forget. Let's see if I, <laughs> if I can do it without forgetting today. Extended stuff, they want. Walker 49, they want to say G, so they're at the best. 00 for now. Southwest 66, turn right heading 090. Right 090, Southwest 66. November 5615, November, 4 miles from Unville, turn right heading 160, maintain 2100 until established, clear to ILS from 1 down approach. Right turn 160, and we'll maintain 2100 till established, clear for the ILS 19 approach, 15 November. Alright, uh, let's approach. Back on 831, to capture the load. I don't think it is, I'm going to take right over. Oh, jeez. Alright, so down to 2100 now, I'm just going to hand fly the rest of the way. My rudder trim is all the way to the right because of the autopilot. That was such a sloppy disconnect. Pilot Club 515, turn right heading 150. Alright, 2100. Pilot Club 526, turn right heading 080. Let's go back right. To right intercept. Overshot there a little bit. Pilot 
Five Club Flight 38, turn left heading 360, vectors for sequence. This wind up here is wicked. Cooper 982, Romeo Sierra, turn left heading 330, vectors for sequence. Turn left to 330. Denver 5615 November, contact Teterboro Tower, 119.5. 119.5, 15 November, see ya. Five Club 26, turn right heading 130. Sir, 907 Mike, contact departure 128.55. Good night. 2855, good night. 907 Mike. Teterboro Tower, good evening. TBM 5615 November on the ILS 19er. TBM 5615 November, Teterboro Tower. Hello, runway 19, you're clear to land the wind 205. There will be departure on the crossing runway prior to your arrival. Clear to land 19, 15 November. Oh wait, 2100, altitude. Yeah, you're supposed to be warm even before I get there. Not when I'm a thousand feet below. Stupid airplane. I'm just kidding. Temple 1910, runway 24, line up and wait, ground traffic crosses downfield. Get this baby slowed down. It's still descending, come on. Temple 1910, Tower. 1910, go ahead. Jump the 1910, runway 24, right, 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 Light soap is live. Delta 1910, runway 24, clear for takeoff. Clear for takeoff, 24, Delta 1910. I started filling out that application for uh, United Aviate program. I don't know how much they'll be able to help me out financially, but I did see what you were talking about, Ro Hype. They are up paying for PPLs right now if you join the program. I'm not sure what kind of financial help I'll get already having a PPL, but I applied anyways. May as well get myself in the system. If they're ever super, super, super desperate and want to pay for all the training, they can call me. <laughs> Alright, we've got one more notch of flaps to go. I'm going to keep our speed up a little until we get a little bit closer. Four landing checklist. 2855, Jeffrey, Juliet. All right, uh, short final Kennedy, gear down and green flaps to go. AP and yaw damp. AP is away. Yaw damp's coming uh, off. We can we can look that up and uh, just one notch of flaps to go. Line. We're just doing a VFR quick touch and go over there. At Target 41, Juliet, the skyline route would be following the Hudson River southbound. Is that what we were looking to do? Yes, if possible. Yep. All right, uh, Got the runway at, uh, runway 24, clear for takeoff, make a left turn to, or uh, left uh, crosswind departure. And once we drop that last notch of flaps, left we'll be looking for 85 knots on final. Juliet. Short final. Peterborough Tower, Pilot Club 515, ILS 19er. Pilot Club 515, Peterborough Tower, you're three miles in trail of TBM, runway 19er, clear to land number two. Clear to land number two, runway one niner. I was up at fifteen. All right, so we're going to be exiting to the right. We're going to signature west. There's three different signature FBOs here, at Teterboro. <laughs> we're going to go to the one on the west side. Should be right there once we exit on the right. All right, rest of those flaps before, uh, before landing checklist complete. Clear to land, one nine. Five hundred. Five hundred. Oh, 
One last gear check. Check for until they cancel takeoff, grant all position. Holding position. Looking good. Peterborough Tower, good. Uh, helicopter 522 Victor, about five miles to the south, inbound on the Sierra route, like to uh, uh, land at the south ramp. Helicopter 522 Victor, Peterborough Tower, Peterborough Tower, 3014, you can proceed via Sierra route as requested for the south ramp. Proceed as requested via Sierra route to the south ramp, 3014, helicopter 522 Victor. Tower, good evening, Cloud Club 826, Cloud Club 26, you're uh, three miles from the trail of uh, Company Citation, runway 19, clear to land. Clear to land, 19, we have the traffic, Cloud Club 826. Alright, extra long landings. Cloud Club 515, go around. <laughs> go around. Sorry, I'm sorry guy. Trying to get in the beta, but my button doesn't work half the time. There it goes. Pilot Club 515, climb maintain 3,000. Up to 3,000, Pilot Club 515. Get off here. Pilot Club 515, turn writing 250. Right to 250, Pilot Club 515. It works when I don't want it to work, and it doesn't work when I want it to work. Tower, Pilot Cub 341, request a uh, full stop, currently 2,500 to the north, or I mean, uh, 1,700 to the north. Runway clear, taxi lights. Pilot Cub 341, were you talking to the approach control? Uh, lights, de-ice. Oh uh, yes, they just sent me over to Tower. It is off, and there's set, Pilot Cub 341, I didn't hear about you. you know, um, Looks like you've got traffic 12 o'clock, about a mile, at 2,500 to Kodiak. Yeah, that, that traffic is in sight. And cool. flaps up. You can follow him. Uh, looks like you're number four for only one diner. Yeah, we'll follow that traffic. We're number four, uh, Pilot Cup 341. Actually, we're going to go to Jet Aviation since it's right here. 128.55. 2855, Pilot Cup 515. 2941, Julia, thanks for waiting. You run my 2 4 clear for takeoff, left turn for the river. See his ground on. Teterboro ground, 121.9. Yeah, Pilot Club 34, no, I'm sorry, you surprised me. They didn't tell me about you at all. Teterboro ground, good evening. TBM 5615, November is clear of 19 at Juliet. We're going to Jet Aviation. TBM 5615, November, Teterboro ground, continue to Jet via Juliet. Continue to Jet via Juliet, 15 November. Clear right, clear left, straight into here is Jet Aviation. Yeah, good fixings don't mess up. <laughs> I think I did pretty well there. Pretty smooth flight today. No, no screw ups really. We couldn't get the procedure dialed in in the Garmin Good evening, Pilot for whatever uh, reason. Of, uh, but we were able to manually plug in the localizer frequency and approach course and blew the ILS that way. We're going to uh, the terminal. Whatever. Other than that little hiccup, uh, flight free. was pretty smooth. How you doing, good fixins? Um, you flying tonight? There's no terminal here, but you can continue into the ramp via Juliet. Alright, I apologize, that's what I meant, uh, straight ahead on Juliet, uh, Pilot Club 826. No problem. And somewhere in the contract, I'm sure you'll agree to fly it. Yeah, I would do it, man. I would definitely sell my soul if they were to help me out. FF Poke, what's going on? Welcome. My current favorite is the PA28 Aero 3. 
Is that the one from Just Flight? I've been wanting to pick up. I want to pick up, not the arrow, but the the slower fixed gear, the warrior. I've been eyeing the warrior for a long time. I want to pick that thing up. I might as well get the bundle, right? I'll probably buy both at the same time when I do. See, who should I park next to? Go park next to this guy. I have a handful of airplanes on my wish list okay, right now. Three twelve, requesting ICAR clearance to Boston. United three twelve, uh, deliveries on twenty oh five. Twenty oh five, sorry. United That's a nice favorite FF no poke. Definitely a cool airplane. Parking brake. Shut down brakes are on, exterior lights. You go ground, stop at 66. You'll select a manual. South of 66, uh. AP trims off. Uh, continue straight on Juliet, uh, to jet. Leads Turn off. Juliet for a top left. Uh, throttle, flight idle for two minutes. We'll let it sit here for another yeah, minute and a half, and we'll go to low idle for 15 November, seconds, and then cut off. November 8060, November runway 24, taxi, Quebec, hold for runway 19. Hey, TPC! Quebec, short of runway 19, for a 6 0 November. Good fixins. I have the arrow and the turbo arrow, and they're both pretty good. I just can't really fit them because the sim is so bad for for me. It, why is it so bad for you, good fixins? Just doesn't have that level of uh, realism as X-Plain, or is it like a performance thing, like PC performance? Gotcha. Control issues bugs since SU5 that haven't been fixed. Gotcha, man. Alright, let's go to low idle. Let's see if I can get this right, because this is tricky. It reads the input from my SciTech throttle, and sometimes it jumps around and doesn't do what it's supposed to do. So let's see if we can get it into low idle. No. It's not. I've got to do something with my TPM here. Uh, like it never makes sense. Yeah, sir. Okay, taxi on Juliet. Yeah, you can just uh, enter the ramp right there. You're basically on it. All right, sir. Okay. We want to be there. Now we want to go down one more. For 15 seconds. Yeah, I had a problem with this thing. That was a, one thing we had starting today's flight. We had to restart two or three times because this thing would not go where I wanted it to go. Inertial set. Off. Generator off, source, and crash lever. So it's going to all come down. Yeah, we'll get the rest of our switches off. Parking brake is set. Yeah, yeah. Four speed shifter. <laughs> Looks like one, huh? <laughs> Alright, I don't think I'm going to do another one tonight. I think I'm done. Um, tomorrow is Friday. I don't think there's any events with the two clubs. Let me see, maybe TPC does have something. If not, there's the FNO. We'll see where that's at. Um, TPC. 
All right, so they're doing the FNO tomorrow. Oh, March craziness is the FNO? Let's see what this is about. All right, he doesn't have too much information on the website here. Let me go to VAT USA. Tomorrow's the 11th. Hey, Expressway Visual, thanks for the follow, man. Welcome to the channel. We just got done. You missed it. But good to have you on, man. We'll be streaming again tomorrow around the same time, about 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, Midnight Zulu. Let's see what we got tomorrow for Friday. We've got March craziness. Okay, I think it's just going to be... I don't think it's any particular airports. I think the just the entire U.S. is going to light up, hopefully. But we'll see. I don't have anything planned for tomorrow. We'll wing it. We'll figure something out tomorrow. Maybe we'll do a citation flight, or maybe we'll do another TBM flight and get some more practice in this thing. And then the weekend... Uh, let's see, Saturday... Oh wait, wasn't this last weekend? Am I even looking at the right dates? We'll probably join the pilot club for these two flights this weekend. We've got one on Saturday, looks like, and I'm going to say that's Anchorage, Alaska. Papa Alpha, Juliet, November. Looks familiar. I think that's Anchorage. So we'll be flying in or out of there. And then on Sunday... Sunday, fun day, 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. It's going to be Key West to Raleigh-Durham. Probably definitely do that one. That's going to be it for me, guys. I'm out of here. I hope you guys have a great day, great night. Thanks for the new follow. Expressway Visual. I appreciate you, man. I'll see you guys on the next one, hopefully tomorrow. Let's see uh, if we have anybody to raid tonight, and I'll send you guys over there. Stand by one. Let's see who we got. Alright, we're going to go to, if you guys want to see controlling tonight, my good friend, Jet Pilot Cinnamon, Mike Sinant. He's the guy that started the Virtual USA Flying Club. He's a real-world jet pilot um, in between airlines right now. I can't give too much information. He likes to keep that stuff private. Um, but he's controlling, I think, JFK Tower right now, and then later he's going to move to Teterboro Tower at around 10 p.m., 15 minutes, I think. So I'm going to send you guys over to him. And I hope you guys have a great day. See ya.